Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. I'm in a bit of a different location for today's clothing haul. So obviously I've moved to Perth and have been spending some time setting up my filming space and I'm super excited to be filming here for the first time today. So for today's video I've teamed up with Princess Polly once again. They're literally like probably my favorite online shop. I just love the style of their clothes. They fit really well, they're really good quality, and they ship to you really fast. So I thought for today, I do have like some festive makeup going on. I just used like a glitter liner to do like a glitter wing. Not sure how well you can see it. So the outfits that I've chosen for this video are more like festy, summer, sort of type outfits, maybe some inspo for Christmas day. If you have a work event, I've got some heels, some runners, some jumpsuits, some cute tops, some jeans, a cool belt, a dress, some shorts. So I've got so many different combos and outfit ideas for you guys. So I'm just gonna jump straight into it and show you guys what I got. But first, don't forget that I do have a discount code again. I will leave it on the screen somewhere and I'll make sure I list all the links to every piece in the description box down below. So so let's go ahead and get started. Before I forget, I did pick up this um, layered necklace. It's from Mink Collections, but I just really picked it up for this really thin gold middle chain i just think it looks so so cute and necklaces definitely dress up any outfit with an open sort of chest like this um so i just wanted to quickly show you guys that before i forget so the first up i got was this motel rocks butterfly crop it is amazing i did end up getting a medium because i wasn't sure that you could um adjust both bottom and top straps but I mainly just wanted to get a medium for my boobs. I haven't actually done this up as tight as I can, but I might do that now. But yeah, both are adjustable. I have fairly large boobs, I guess, double Ds. I feel like the medium does fit my cup size perfectly. Um, you could wear this loose. You can tighten it up as tight as you want, but I kind of like the fit of this. And then I paired the top with these Levi's. They're like a charcoal-y, color and they are so comfortable i'm gonna have to show you guys what they look like down okay so here is what the jeans look like they're not like super super high waist like they do come just above my belly button but this is what they look like they've got like a raw hem at the bottoms and they flare out a little bit but not too much but I thought this outfit would look really cute with this Diamante belt. I've actually been eyeing this on the website for ages and I feel like this would just turn this casual type outfit to something a little bit more dressy and nighttime appropriate. Oh my gosh, this is so big. Oh my god, how cute is the belt? I probably should have done it a bit tighter, but I didn't want to um, break it. How cool. And you could also wear this belt like around like a slip dress. I reckon it would look really cute with like a, like a silky dress like this. If this was plain, I would definitely pair a belt like this with it just to make it a little bit more glam. And I did also pick up these Bellini shoes. I absolutely love these because they're not too high. Um, and they're just like the perfect little black strappy shoe. So I'll put that on and show you guys what it looks like with this outfit. Okay, so these are what the shoes look like on. Oh my God, they're literally the perfect height. And I feel like if I went out in these, I wouldn't be complaining like an hour after I put them on. Whoa. I love this so much that is my first outfit oh my god they did have like a matching mini skirt on the website i probably would have picked it up if it was like a longer skirt but how freaking cute would this be for christmas i think i ended up getting a size let me check Eight. So this top also has adjustable straps, so you can make it as tight or as loose as you want. We're actually going out tonight, so I think I might wear this top. Oh my 
really like and I think it looks really cute with the necklace as well. Love! I would definitely wear this with those shoes that I tried on before. Oh, I can't get over this top. It also makes my boobs look good. Okay, this is the next top I got. It's just basically a knitted um, turtleneck top. I'm obsessed with turtlenecks. So I really wanted to get a sleeveless one for summer. I'm just tucking it into the jeans. You could also wear this with that belt as well or any other belt to dress it up. I feel like a top like this is just super, super versatile and it's such a good staple basic to have in your collection. I'm actually very surprised that I don't have this in my collection yet. Um, but every single time I go onto the website, I always eye it off, but I think they have been out of stock in the eight. So this is a size eight. It's not skin tight, like I can't breathe in it. Um, it does go to about here in length, but as I said, I would tuck it in and I would wear something like this with jeans like I am now, a denim skirt, some shorts, like a long sort of like midi skirt that would look really cute. Um, but yeah, I just love this top and I'm actually super surprised that I don't have this in my collection right now. I'm probably going to have to get all the other colors that they have. Um, so yeah, that is the next top that I picked up. Oh my God, this dress is so cute. Whoa, I am not normally a dress kind of girl. It gives me like... What's that brand, like Versace type vibes? I would definitely wear this dress with these heels. I'll pop them on so you guys can see. But I did end up getting this dress in a 10 just because I was a bit skeptical that the eight would fit around my bust because it doesn't have a zip or anything. It's just a like a slip dress that you just put it straight on. Um, so yeah, I was just a bit worried about my boobs, but the 10 fits me absolutely perfectly. I'm so glad I ended up getting a 10. It does have adjustable straps, so pretty. Okay, I'm going to put these on. Okay, I'll just move the camera down so you can see what my heels look like with the dress. Wow. It's also not too short at the back. That's probably why I hate wearing dresses because I'm just always scared that I'm going to flash. But I really love the slit on the left leg. This would also look cute with like a, maybe a thin basic belt if you did want to accentuate your waist. Probably wouldn't pair it with the Diamante one because it is a patterned dress, but I definitely would put maybe like a, yeah, a thin black belt around the waist, but I also would just wear it like this as well. Oh my God. Stop. Okay. I never wear jumpsuits ever and I don't know why this is honestly the cutest thing I have I'm shook so I feel like the reason why I don't normally go for play suits is I either pick up ones that are too tight around here that make me look bigger than I am or they don't accentuate the waist and they kind of just flow out because I feel like when you accentuate your waist and your smallest parts of your body, it just is more fluttering. But this is literally the perfect example of how a play suit should look. Well, in my opinion anyways. Um, I love the like ruching detail on the boob area. I did get a size 10 um, just to make sure because I wasn't sure if it was going to be a giving material, which it isn't. Um, it's pretty straight, like just straight up. It doesn't really have that stretch. So yeah, if I would say it's more like, I guess more true to size. Um, I don't really buy play suits as much, but I'm very glad that I would attend because I don't think the eight would have fit. Um, it is still pretty firm around my boobs, but it's not restricting or anything. That is what the back looks like. It's not digging in or anything. I feel like if I did pick up the eight, there would be some overhang. But wow, I'm also wearing those same shoes and they look so cute together. I feel like I like this more to wear on Christmas day. I was gonna pair it with a red lip but I feel like red and green would be a little bit too over the top but I am gonna change my lip color 
for the last couple of outfits in case you wanted some red lip outfit inspo as well. But I am so obsessed with this, like you have no idea. Hugs are in the right places. It's not too flowy and too frilly. I think that's what puts me off again with play suits. In case you wanted to see it with the shoes on, I just zoomed the camera down. But these shoes are honestly perfect. I love them. Oh my God, what is wrong with me? Why don't I pick up dresses or wear dresses? I'm more like a crop and either jeans or skirt type of girl like when I go out or I'll wear like trouser pants with a crop or I'll just never even wear a play suit or even a dress like this. How gorgeous is the detail on this dress? I'm not sure how well you can see it, but it's like a florally print. I did end up getting this one in a size 10 too, just because of the cups as well. It is quite roomy around my bust, but I would definitely rather roomy than tight. Um, obviously, it's nice and flowy down the bottom. Size 10 fits absolutely perfectly. I think if I got an 8, the cups would have looked a bit funny. I don't think they fit 100%, but I feel like I can get away with wearing this size. So I was going to put a red lip on, but I thought I would show you guys first with a nude lip, but now I'm going to change my lip color for the next couple of outfits to a red lip. So I just popped on a red lip, and for those that are going to spam the comments, it is Ruby Woo by MAC. It is honestly the perfect blue-based red I have ever, ever used in my life. It's one of my all-time favorites. I use it in my kit as well. They also stock MAC Cosmetics on Princess Polly, so if you wanted to grab it. Um, my other faves are definitely Honey Love and Velvet Teddy if you... Um, wanted some nude recommendations, but this is literally my all-time favorite red lipstick. It doesn't make your teeth look yellow. It literally makes your teeth look so white. I freaking love it. So this is what the outfit... Oh, let's pull this down a bit. So this is the dress with the red lip. To be honest, it's a vibe. I wasn't sure because I know that this red is more of like a... In between like a burgundy deep red. Actually, you know what other color would look really nice with this dress? Russian Red by MAC. It's very similar to this color. Whereas the red that I'm wearing now is more of like a vibrant, like in your face red, but it's still definitely my favorite. Um, so yeah, that's what the dress looks like with the red lips. And I am literally in love. Oh my God, how cute does this outfit look? So the top that I got is this, I just love cropped, long sleeve, bubbly tops. I have so many in my collection, but I don't have a color like this, and I absolutely love it. It has an open back, which I find so flattering. I freaking love open backs. And I love how you can tie it to as loose or as tight as you want. So basically, I did get a size eight, um, and it fits me really well around my shoulders and arms, and it's got enough material for my boobs, which I actually was a bit skeptical about. Um, but it does definitely cover up my boobs. And I just did two little bows here. So there's like two separate um, little tie-up things and you just tie it up in the center. And then I picked up these white shorts. So I did get them in a size 10. I get all my shorts in a size 10. I'm on my tippy toes because I can't be bothered putting the camera up. But yeah, these shorts are super, super flattering. They're not too tight or they don't dig in. Um, and they fit my bum really well. I feel like buying denim shorts are a bit of a hit or miss for me just because I do have a smaller waist and thicker thighs. So if they are too tight on my thighs, they fit my waist or sometimes they fit my waist and they're too like tight on my thighs. But these are not restricting at all. I don't have that gap that I normally do with denim, just because my waist is a lot smaller than my bottom half of my body, but they do fit really, really well, and I love, love this outfit together. I think for an outfit like this, you could dress it up by wearing those um, heels, a white or even a black pair of heels would look really nice with this outfit, or you could dress it down for like a daytime event just with wearing sneakers. Um, I personally would wear like a light or a white colored sneaker um but that's completely up to you i did pick up these new balances mainly 
for the gym. So I'm not sure if that's focusing or you can see the color, but it's basically like a lighter beige than my top. So that's like the base color of these shoes. And then it has really cute blue and pink details around the side. As I said, I probably would more likely wear shoes like this to the gym. That's why I picked them up. But I'm going to show you guys what they look like with this outfit just so you can see um, what sneakers would look like with an outfit like this. Okay, so I don't know why I'm mentioning these. So random. But these are probably the best freaking sockets ever. I have like four or five sets of them. They're just the Vans ones. They're really thick and they don't slide down. So I always wear these with my gym um, shoes or even just my sneakers. So they're literally like no-show van socks. Highly recommend them if you're looking for good socks. Okay, I'm gonna put these on and show you guys what sneakers look like with an outfit like this. I have a feeling I might actually even like these like to wear with this outfit. Oh my God, these are so comfortable. I feel like people underestimate New Balance. Like my favorite gym shoes are actually from Princess Polly and then New Balance. I think they're still on the website. Sorry if I'm like flashing. But um, yeah, they're literally my favorite freaking shoe and I get so many compliments on them. They're just plain white. And I freaking love them for the gym. Okay, this is a vibe. I freaking love these shoes with this outfit. Like when I did add them to my cart, I didn't think that I would be putting them on with this outfit. I was just gonna wear some other white shoes, but I think these look really cute with this outfit. Like obviously I would wear these to the gym as well because they're so supportive and comfortable, but whoa, I actually love these shoes. I think they do have like a pastel pink and blue version but they were out of stock but i'm definitely gonna have to pick them up after getting these if they're the same because these are freaking comfortable okay so the next top i picked up is this one it looked super cute on the website so i had to pick it up personally i think i would need booby tape just in case this came across it is on the tightest so again it does have adjustable straps so you can make this as tight or as loose as you want you could even loosen it up and put like a bikini on underneath so it has that sort of like over the top top vibes if you get what I mean um, but I just would be very weary of my nipples in this top just because it isn't super super tight other than that it is really cute with these shorts it's definitely more of like a lunch like breakfast type outfit or even like beach but yeah it's really cute I'm actually really glad I picked it up because I don't really have that many tops like this like flowy little crops so yeah i'm really glad i picked this one up it's super super cute oh this is a bit cute for me i'm not usually one to wear flowy tops like this this is really cute with the lips whoa i actually love that I didn't think I would actually like it, but I do. I did end up getting a size eight. So it's more of a relaxed fit at the back. And then the front is like this. It does have two tie up things. So you can make this tight or as loose as you want. Again, I reckon this would look really cute if you wanted to pair it with a bikini on underneath and just make this real loose, maybe like off the shoulder, sort of like, oh, that even looks cute. Wait, <gasps> stop. That is cute. Okay, I freaking love this top. I think it's my favorite one that I got today. And how cute do they look like with the shorts? You could wear a belt with this outfit, probably even the Diamante one if you wanted to make it look extra glam. Maybe a beige or a black one would look really cute. And you could definitely pair this outfit with either the sneakers that I'm wearing or even dress it up with the heels but I freaking love this top so much. I feel like all of the outfits I picked out are all like festy type outfits that you can wear. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Don't forget to thumbs up if you want to see more videos like this. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget that Princess Polly have given me a discount code. I will leave it on the screen again and in the description box down below. But for now, I will see you in my next video.
Bye guys.